Good morning. It's Monday. Yay. Said no one ever. It's raining here. Can't wait. I'm kind of sick of this rain. I know what they say. April shower brings May flowers. Blah, 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 blah. Whatever. But back to the grind. Headed after work. And I'll catch you to invest in a raincoat. I'm soaked. But, oh well. It'll dry. I won't melt. Because I don't think so. Off work. Heading home. It's finally stopped raining. It's been raining all day here. It's like a monsoon all day. Heading home. See what Josh has made us for dinner. See what else we can get into. I spoke too soon. Now it's raining. On my way home. drive to work through cornfields. Well, not really through, but definitely a roll. Roll? I can never say that word properly. I totally forgot to film what we're having for dinner. Started chatting and it's like, oh yeah. Forgot to have that, but we had calzones that had like buffalo chicken and cheese in it. And I also did film my lunch, but I didn't say anything because my coworker was in there and she was looking at me funny. So now I'm going to insert footage of that. So about two weeks ago, yeah, two weeks ago today, um, I lost my dog. I didn't lose her. She died. And as a fur mommy, as a dog mom, that's, like, the hardest thing I've ever had to go through. Like, I made that choice. I was in there when they put her to sleep. Um, it was very calm and peaceful. Um, it's so hard, like, even to this day, I still feel like I hear her. Um, towards the end, for the past three months prior, she had heart problems. She had, um, a heart murmur and, like, bowel problems, and her lungs were full of fluid, so she was on some heart meds, um, but the last couple of days before she died, she just didn't want to eat, she didn't want to take her medication, and Monday I came home from work, and I can just tell she was done. So we took her to the vet and we made that decision, put her down. And that was hard. No one prepares you for that. They tell you it's going to be hard, but they never prepare you for it. And this is the first time in like two weeks I've been able to talk about it and not cry. Like straight up ball. Um, we did have her cremated. We have her here at home. I'm waiting on her urn to come. I got her this beautiful urn um and I'll show you that when it arrives her name was Daisy so of course I had to have an urn with daisies on it and it's gorgeous I can't wait till it arrives so I can show you and so she can have her final final place where she belongs but she's here at home with me and that's all that matters so <clears throat> I finished selling sunset which, now I'm ready for the next season. Now I started watching Gaslight on Hulu. Which is supposed to be about um, Watergate scandal. So hopefully this will be good. I'm sure it's about true crime. It's my jam. So I'm almost done with my book, my friend Anna. I don't know what to read next. Any suggestions? I have a few that are staring at me like, please read me, but I don't know. Of course, I'll throw the flap out. But anyways, I'm tired. I'm gonna head to bed here shortly. Um, I got like four hours of sleep last night because I couldn't sleep. Probably because I knew it's Monday and I hate Mondays. <laughs> I mean, doesn't everybody. Anyways, so I guess I'll end it here. 
Um, like, subscribe so you can hang out with us in this crazy thing called life. And then I'll catch you on the flippy flip.